Right guys, today you join me here at Jack Shack. Uh, just near, just north of Leicester actually, so in the middle of the UK. And I'm here to have a look at all around the workshop, see what they get up to. Uh, it's a little bit different to your usual campervan conversion company here. So they do their campervans, but they also build hot rods, which is so cool. So we'll have a look at some of the campervans, see what they do, but a little Easter egg, we'll be going out in a beast of a truck, a hot rod truck. So stay tuned. Yep. So you're just gonna fire questions at me now, Lance. So what Jack Shack does, we build brand spanking new T6 camper vans, T5 camper vans, and custom trucks, custom cars, anything from engineering and fabrication. Every time I go to a hot rod show, I have to come at the show, so it made sense to get into campers at the same time. Probably Chris's, yeah. The swamper that we've just done on our website, low level kitchen, knobbly tires, snorkel, that's my sort of yeah, that version. Sounds cool. Believe it or not, we went on a stag do to Germany and I met a chap called Chris and we just hit it off and he rented one of these vans and I was just slating the van um, and I thought I could build better. That's how it started. We, we just went with it and this is where we are today. So. Yes, definitely that. So we've got a 50s truck on the shelf which I'm aiming to put a aluminium airstream, so like the old 50s caravan on the back, but convert it as a full camper van inside. So let's have a look at a typical camper van that uh, Jack Shack build here. Like I say, they're all bespoke, so you can have pretty much anything, but this one looks pretty cool on these wheels. So let's take a look at this one. Now it's over to me to give you a quick tour of some of these campers. Sean already mentioned that you can build these pretty much exactly as you like and he's really not wrong. I had a lot of fun using their online configurator to make just about every camper van colour combo you can imagine. I'll link the configurator in the description below because it's great seeing what individual designs you can come up with. There is also pricing of each item so you get a good idea of cost. From drawing up your own designs to your camper van, being on the road usually takes around two months, which is pretty good since it's totally bespoke. Most campers come with a dual hob, sink and fridge, but you can spec an oven if you want one. There's plenty of storage and the cab area has captain's chairs and an RIB bed, along with another double bed in the pop top roof. The vans are heated by a diesel heater, which we've always found to be reliable, and you've got an onboard water tank. The brand new base vans tend to come with all the features you might expect on a top of the range car. What makes Jack Shack stand out is the consumer friendly website with a configurator with all its pricing, which you don't often see. As well as the camp vans that we've had a look around, you can see here there's actually four transporters as well that have been uh, that are sat waiting to be turned into camper vans. Uh, so yeah, I don't think they can build them quick enough. Camp vans at the minute are in uh, high demand, so it's, it's great to see they've got some stock ready to go. So this is the Jackal, tell us a bit about your so, creation. Right, what we have here is a 1952 Ford F1, which started life as just a farm truck. We've literally took it to pieces, extended the bodder, so it was a, it was a six foot bed, 
which we've turned it into an eight foot bed, all fabbed in house. We've extended the wheel arches there, which has allowed the 20 inch, the 12 inch wheels on the rear. It's now a diesel, not a straight six petrol. So what's in it is a Mercedes six cylinder. It's an OM606, backed up by a TH400 transmission. So basically no clutch, it's just a ratchet shift automatic box. The truck pushes about 500 horsepower to the rear wheels. But every every last piece on the truck is custom apart from the cab. So we've apart from welding the cab, we've not altered anything. How long uh, did it take to create? So it's been in the making of two years, but it's not we've not been on it every day. Like obviously I work full time, so we have literally been nights. Nice. It's been a night project. And inside the truck. Every, everything in there as you see, so that's fully custom. Um, I went with the Ali aircraft bomber seats. I wanted I wanted everything to be fabbed in the truck. Just to show the skill that we are about at Jack Shack. in the jackal this look at the roof how cool is that When I was 14 at hot rod shows, everyone had uh, something called top rods. I've had, I had this, so I thought I'll put a 200cc cart motor in it and just stand out from the crowd really, be a bit different. It's uh, just about 35 miles an hour on the back wheels. <laughs> I, think, I think there's some footage of it, to be fair, on our Instagram. We did a, well, all the lads got it out in the day and everyone were racing it. I'd show you now, but the clutch is burnt out, so I can't. 